Welcome to Madam English YouTube channel. In this video, you will hear a report text. Listen to the report text about cities. After that, answer the questions based on the text. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe Madam English YouTube channel. Thank you. Cities are the centers of economic, cultural, and political activity around the world. They are characterized by high population density, diverse populations, and a wide range of economic and social opportunities. One of the defining features of cities is their economic activity. Cities are home to a large number of businesses, both small and large, and they attract workers from all over looking for employment. This economic activity leads to a concentration of wealth and poverty, as well as a wide range of job opportunities. Cities are also known for their cultural diversity. People from all over the world come to cities in search of new opportunities and experiences. This diversity is reflected in the variety of languages, religions, and customs found in cities. Another key feature of cities is their infrastructure and transportation. Cities have a well-developed transportation system which makes it easy for people to move around. This includes public transportation such as buses, trains and subway, as well as private transportation such as cars and bicycles. Despite the many benefits of cities, they also come with their own set of challenges. Urbanization can lead to overcrowding, pollution, and a lack of affordable housing. Cities can also experience economic and social inequality, as well as crime and safety concerns. Overall, cities are complex and dynamic places that offer a wide range of opportunities and challenges. They attract people from all over the world and shape the way we live, work, and interact with each other. They are the engines of economic growth, cultural exchange, and innovation. Now, answer the following questions. Question number one. What is the social function of the text? Question number two. What are the structures of the text? Question number three. What are the language features of the text? Question number four. What is the main point of the text?